Hey y'all, it's Lori here at Beauty Where You Find It, and it is time for the January Ipsy unbagging. I always call it an unboxing, but really, it's two bags. So, we have got what looks like kind of a marbled bag. It feels almost waterproof, probably not actually waterproof, but like, I would probably put like things in here I didn't want to leak elsewhere. Lotions, face wash, whatever. So this is the January Clean Slate. Got it going on. Okay. Not going to look inside there. Let's see what we got. Ojos Perfectos Liquid Eyeliner in Coffee or Cafe from Araceli. Araceli. So it's, it's an eyeliner. Um, I'm going to be real brave, you guys. And I'm going to try to put this on with you because I've told you guys I don't do eyeliner. But let's see what happens. I specifically don't love these that are like the felt tip, like uh, calligraphy pen type. <laughs> but we're going to try it out. Let's just see what happens. Oh, already bad. Already bad. It's so wet, y'all. All right. I kind of drew straight lines. You guys can't really see them very well. Let's see if I can tight zoom in. Those don't look even. <laughs> Y'all, that's hilarious. Let's see if I can make it a wing. <laughs> I don't know why this is so funny, y'all. It's about to get exciting. Okay, so I'm going to go up, and then I'm going to meet it. All right. Well, those don't match at all, y'all. Like, this one is, like, real thick and kind of going down. And this one is, like, real angular. It actually kind of looks like a wing liner. This one looks like I got a black eye. <laughs> okay, see the difference? Like, black eye, kind of, wait, let me make sure. Nope, black eye, almost like a real wing. Let's close it. Not so much. But I feel like this one gets a gold star. Like, the first time I'm doing a wing liner, like, you guys... You saw that, right? Like, it just happened. Maybe the, like, trick is to not care too much and just, like, go for it. Or maybe this is a really good pen. I don't know, but I'm going to keep trying. Maybe I'll start doing, um, eyeliner for work all the time because, like, you know, I'm not trying to, like, meet people at work, so I can look kind of not crazy, but, like, try things. So, <laughs> all right. The next thing is called Clean It Zero Cleansing Balm Original. I feel like there's been a lot of pink products and I am here for it, even though you guys can definitely not see that because of the brightness of the lights in the beauty closet, but that's fine. So Cleansing Balm, let's see if I can tell where it's from, made in, ooh, Korea, we can try this one. Now it's exciting and it's small so I could travel with it. Okay, next is, oop, from Morphe Fluidity Full Coverage Concealer. Okay, all right. In the shade Soft Matte, CL55. Um, I've never actually tried any Morphe um, face products, like no concealer, um, foundation is the word I'm looking for. Okay, let's see. That actually might really be light enough. I was worried it was going to be dark. Let's see. But it's not. Y'all see the little circle? That actually kind of looks good. We'll try it out this week and see. All right. La oh, not last. There's two things. Next to last, Charcoal Bamboo Detoxifying Body Scrub. Made with jojoba oil, sweet almond oil, and sesame oil. It's a lot of oil, y'all. Um, let's 
see. I can't really tell. Oh, made in China. Okay. Gently massage onto wet skin and rinse. Okay. I like that it's for the whole body, like not just for the face, because you can do like your shoulders if you have breakouts, or like your chest, um, and it not mess you up. It's called Theory. It's like I didn't say that. Theory. <laughs> theory body. Okay. And then for sure last is Beauty for Real. Brooke, USA. I don't know. Oh, it's a lip balm. Okay. Beauty for Real. Brooke, USA. Would it help if I did it the right way, you guys? <laughs> I'm killing it with these beauty reviews. You have to admit. Like, you come for the beauty, but you stay for the humor. And, like, the epic fails. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, that's a pretty color. Um, oh, I couldn't get it to, like, it's still not turning. Like, it's turning, but it's not going up. Hmm. Well, that might be a fail all on its own. It smells nice. It smells like a tart eyeshadow palette. You know what I'm talking about? Like, kind of like sweet vanilla kind of aroma. Aroma, not a roamer. <laughs> but I really can't get it to lift. That's really disappointing. Okay. Well, they tried. All right. So, Ipsy, January. I feel very dramatic. Like, I feel like I can kind of tell that I have the fling eyeliner on. Um, the lip balm that doesn't work. The uh, charcoal body scrub. The zero face balm. The Morphe concealer. Definitely excited to try that. And the eyeliner, which we have on my eye already. Like it's been out of the bag five minutes and I've already used it. So if that's not a win, I don't know what is. I keep watching myself in the monitor because I'm not used to having a monitor and that's what I like about this camera, which is why I'm trying to make it work, you guys. I know the sound is a little weird and I'm still working on the light, but like I like that I can actually see myself because before I was using my DLSR like digital camera and I had to put like a mirror behind it and kind of like see and set up and then be like, whatever's happening is happening. No idea. So, um, just keep, please keep following, and if you like what I do, like it and subscribe and give me some feedback. Positive or constructive criticism, just don't be mean. Um, and I will keep trying. I will keep trying to get better. I did order a microphone that apparently does not work with this camera, so that was not helpful at all. But I'm here, and I'm trying, and I hope you guys are at least enjoying some of it. Ipsy, I mean, it's a yes, y'all. <laughs>